Hello, welcome back to the channel. Bit of a sad one today, I'm afraid. Today we're going to be doing the murder of Lucy McHugh, 13 year old schoolgirl. She was murdered here at Southampton Sports Centre on the 25th of July 2018. Now, her body was actually found at quarter to eight the next day on the 26th of July 2018. Lucy was a schoolgirl that attended Redbridge Community School and it shocked the area when this happened. She was murdered by Stephen Nicholson who I'm not going to do anything about in this video. I've got another video of, uh, of him um, where well, I'll go a little bit more in depth. I just wanted to keep this one short but about Lucy and her final route that she took to get here where she met uh, she met her end way too early so i hope you enjoy the video and i'll see you at the beginning so this is a starting point for lucy i decided not to go right from her house um just out of respect really because I, I don't know if her parents still live there or not but just down the road there she lived down there on the left and she would have walked up this road here and she would have come all the way along here and she would have gone left at the roundabout just down there I don't know if you can see that I'll zoom in a little bit she would have gone left up there and that's where she gets her first bit of CCTV footage from there so I will see you there. So Lucy was seen walking past this shop from their CCTV from inside the shop at about two minutes past nine. And then she proceeded to go up the road that way. And I should take you. Unfortunately, I couldn't stop at the hospital um, where the CCTV footage was shot from because there's road works and roads closed and things like that. Um, so I'll show you the CCTV footage for that. Um, from there, she came up to this place here. She walked past there. The camera's just up on the, on the house there. And then she walked past this gate and there's a CCTV footage for that. And then she walked from there all the way up that road there. And as you can see yet again, there's actually road works and the road's shut up that end for going that way. So I'll have to drive all the way around um, and I will see you on the other side. This is unfortunately the last bit of CCTV that Lucy was seen on and the last time she was ever seen. So we're outside the Tesco's now um, on the CCTV footage you can see that she's just walking past the Tesco's it was at 928 she walked past this Tesco's and I'll see you at the next location this is the most likely place that Lucy came in either through that gate there through this gate here but what she would have done is walked up this way here so I'm going to do the walk now but then uh, we fast forward it so you don't have to do the whole walk yourself and apparently <coughs> Lucy told Nicholson that she was pregnant so that's the belief that he lured her here. He said she was going to tell her mum. So he lured her here and took her life. So she wouldn't tell her mum. But he got found out. And now not only is he a paedophile, he's also a murderer. 
so it didn't work out after all. And Lucy lost her life way too early for nothing. So just up here is where Lucy's body was found by the dog walker. We'll uh, try and get there as quick as I can. She would have walked through here. I'm just up on this tree here. Still got some uh, ribbons and stuff that was put there. And Lucy would have come down here. I'm not we're not sure if she's on her own or with Nicholson. But I do have it on authority. I don't know how good that authority is. It's around here to the left on the plateau, on a plateau. Up here. And this is where Lucy would have spent her final moments. Such a waste of life. Just because someone wanted to cover up that he was a paedophile. awful way to lose your life. Well, unfortunately there's not much to see up here, but there's no memorial up here for Lucy. And I'd wondered, maybe with a few donations, that we might be able to get Lucy a bench. And then uh, situate it out here. Thought that'd be a nice little idea. Being a nice, there's a nice little bench here overlooking the rest of the park there, look. There's one memorial bench already over there. I think Lucy Warrant's one being right here. View of the park, lovely idea. Sad, isn't it? Um, anyway, I hope you like the video. I'll leave you with a few pictures of Lucy's memorial. Um, and if you could uh, subscribe, it'd be much appreciated. Like, and also comment. And if you'd like to donate towards Lucy's bench, I'll leave a link at the bottom. Um, that'll also be much appreciated. And I'll get that situated um, in the entrance of where she lost her life, overlooking the park. So thank you for watching and I'll bid you farewell.